My name is Michael Potts. I live on this sailboat. I've been sailing from Toronto all the way down to the Bahamas. And today I'm in uh, North Carolina, heading up this ditch towards Bellhaven, North Carolina. In this episode, I meet one of the coolest American dudes I've ever met. Fellow mariner, fellow person who lives on a sailboat and travels the world, and he helps me fix my mast. Let's get into the episode. So an hour into the day here, and it's, it's just basically a big straight ditch that goes for a very long time. I mean, it does turn at one point. It's quite a ways up there. So just sitting here at the helm like usual. I mean, I wish, I wish it would get warm. I don't know, it's probably like 10 or 12 degrees here. So, yeah, looks like we're gonna get into Bellhaven at 1.41 p.m. Bellhaven is a nice protected anchorage in North Carolina, and it's the perfect place to reprovision and get some downtime. It's a nice calm place where you can anchor your boat and no one will bug you. So we have made it to Bellhaven, North Carolina. That's the city right there. We're in 10 feet of water. Just dropped the hook here. I got, uh, I don't know, 60 feet of chain out, I think. And snubber set. All right. So let's settle in and get uh, a bunch of boat work done and re get some fuel and check out uh, Bellhaven here. When traveling on a sailboat single-handedly, you tend to feel a little isolated. It's always good to meet other people who are doing the exact same thing you are. You instantly become Woo! friends. <laughs> We're so already bumping into you. Oh. <laughs> I got a new buddy. Uh, it's my buddy Jay here. We've been hanging out for a couple days now. Yeah, that's a good little dinghy. All right, so we made it to this like little dock here. And there's a gas station over here. This is Jay, what's up Jay? Say hello to YouTube. Hello YouTube. <laughs> there you go. So we're gonna, we're gonna go to this place called the Food Lion. And uh, we've been there, I was there in, uh, in New Jersey. It was, it's just a great place. Or actually no, uh, Atlantic City. It was a food line. Anyway, I think it's over this way somewhere, so we're gonna walk into the town and go and get a few things from the store. I need to get oil and uh, steak and stuff, and mainly rum. Uh, all right, so we just finished our little shopping dealy at Food Lion. What a great name for a store. I love it, it's Scottish, you know? Like, it's got the, the uh, whatever they call it. The rampant lion. There's an alligator in that hole right there. I just saw him swim out. Yeah. He's in that hole, I just saw him. All right, back to the boat. That's what you do if you need supplies, you just gotta come ashore and walk to wherever and get what you need. I got my bag full of, of things, food and meat and beer and stuff. And we're gonna head back to the boat right now. Let's do it. Alrighty guys, so I've been in this anchorage here in uh, Bellhaven, North Carolina for a few days now. We're, oh jeez. It's been an interesting anchorage because uh, I met another mariner, Jay, and he's on like a 40 foot boat over there. And uh, he's, gonna help me with a few things that I need help with and I really appreciate him doing that you know so he's gonna come over today and we're gonna send him up the mast he wants to go up the mast himself and uh, see what's going on up there so I mean I, I said hey I'd go I'll go up the mast just help crank me up and he was like no no I want to do it so um, I'm really appreciating Jay helping me I mean you know this is I don't have an anchor light I don't have wind, a wind telltale, and I don't have the Raymarine wind instruments. I have them here, new ones. 
that can be put up there. It's just a matter of installing them. So uh, Jay's pretty pretty technical guy. He, he seems to know what's up, and he's willing to go up there and do it. So uh, I'm gonna get everything ready, all the tools, all the pieces that I need, and I'm gonna start laying safety lines and stuff. And I guess he'll come over a little later on in the day once it's a little warmer, because it is pretty cold here. It's December, so almost Christmas. So uh, that's the plan uh, for today. All right, so Jay has elected to go up the mass and fix these issues. And uh, we're doing it as safely as we can. Uh, he's obviously a way more experienced climber than I am. And uh, he's rigged up some ropes and, and uh, we're gonna put him in the bosun's chair. He's gonna go up there, he's got everything he needs. And uh, hopefully we're gonna be able to uh, get this all sorted out. All right, so almost there. All right, so Jay's made it to the top of the mast and he's doing his thing. It is true what they say about American sailors. They're the kindest people in the world. We managed to get my anchor light fixed and installed my Raymarine wind instrument. Jay, if you're watching this, thank you so much for helping me out, brother. next episode we head down to Beaufort near the ocean on our way from Toronto all the way to the Bahamas. As I'm editing this episode I'm actually near Miami so I'm going to be releasing a lot more short videos like this. Hope you liked it. Leave a comment down below. Hit the like button for me and we'll see you in the next video.